Welcome to Aurora Chemistry for Everyone. Let us see hydrolysis and pH of sodium cyanide in this video. First, we will see what is hydrolysis. The interaction of cation, anion or both of salt with water molecule is called hydrolysis. Because of this interaction, there is a change in pH of the solution. Whenever acid reacts with base, it forms salt. Sodium cyanide is a salt which is formed from hydrogen cyanide, a weak acid, and sodium hydroxide, a strong base. When salt interacts with water, it forms aqueous solutions. In the same way, sodium cyanide, when it interacts with water, it dissociates into ions. NaCN, in aqueous solution, it forms Na plus and Cn minus ions. Na plus ion is formed from sodium hydroxide which is a strong base. So it undergoes complete ionization. So it does not undergo hydrolysis. But what happens to this Cn minus ion? This Cn minus ion is formed from hydrogen cyanide which is a weak acid. So because of that it undergoes hydrolysis. That means it will interact with water molecule. So Cn minus ions when interact with water molecule it forms unionized hydrogen cyanide because it is formed from that weak acid that is why it does not undergo complete ionizations and resulting in the formation of OH minus ion concentrations in the solutions because when Cn minus ions interact with water molecule this water molecule also undergoes self ionization it means it forms H plus and OH minus ions. Among these, this H plus ions uh, interact with the Cn minus ions and it forms HCN unionized HCN. And these OH minus ions stays as OH minus ions and increase the concentration of hydroxide ion in aqueous solutions. So because of that, the pH also increases. Whenever a salt is formed from weak acid and strong base, when it interacts with water molecules, the resulting solution's pH is increased. That means it becomes basic solution and the pH is greater than 7. So pH of such solution is greater than 7 and the solution is basic in nature. Thanks for watching.